the horseshoe cut, the typical I am turning 27 this year and I'm already having a receding hairline. Um, and instead of lining it up, I'll just have my horseshoe. <sighs> this makes me so sad. Like, I'll never get over this. It really, it, it hits deep. It hits deep. Um, we're gonna have to take a moment of silence for seven because it just, just, it really hits. Okay, so let's just take a moment to, um, <laughs> trees, stop. We're taking a moment of silence, everybody, okay? Um, in honor of, uh, seven and her legacy. Um, no one was better at harassing women and interior design than seven um, in loving memory now that we've had our moment of silence for seven we need to move on to bigger and better things so <laughs> we're gonna have to make a new person because I, I I feel like it would be disrespectful to try and sit here and recreate seven because she you can't replace her. You just, you can't replace seven. We could always make a relative of 700. We could always make 700's relative. You know, that's always a possibility. You need a backstory on who, on seven, who is that? I'll show you who seven is. You know what, you're asking, I'll show you who seven is. This was 700. This was her. She was beautiful. I need y'all to just, Take a second. I need y'all to take a second and just look at her. So, I mean, I guess we can make Seven's cousin 100. We could do 100. How should I spell one? We'll do, we'll do one. Hundred. Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Um, okay, so here's the thing. Well, I guess, no, all of my cousins are mixed, so he would just be like a mixed. He would be mixed. He would be like my color. I'm not sure how much family resemblance there would be as far as, you know, that goes. Because she was really a legend. He's a simp. Mm, I feel like that makes a lot of sense. It makes a lot of sense. I mean, yeah, there's gonna be some family resemblance. You know what I'm saying? There's gonna be some family resemblance between the two. And I think he will be a simp, but I guess a simp wouldn't necessarily be a ladies man. Cause I was gonna say, I feel like he would be a ladies man, but his jaw, I feel like simps, simps aren't much of chads, you know? They're kind of the opposite. So. There's not a whole lot of Chad chinage going on. He probably has like a really bad overbite. He probably breathes out of his mouth. You know what I'm saying? Like his gums are sticking out of his face. I just spit. <laughs> um, I think so far we're doing pretty good. the eye of the beholder and i believe that this man is beautiful i think that he's actually perfect i think he's the ideal man and 700 probably was proud of him for growing into the beautiful young man that he is to become he's really amazing <laughs> wow his gums. Mmm. 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 He's amazing. I. I've never seen anyone look like this. And I mean that in the best way possible. I mean that. 
in an endearing manner. I think he looks fantastic. Grow a beard to cover up all the exposed gum. <laughs> it's gums. Yeah, God would love him. He's a godly man, you know. Um, Seven was a bit of she was a bit spiritual, but one he ended up Christian. His his parents were just a little more, you know, religious, so. He's more on the religious side of the, on the Christian side of the spectrum, but it's okay. He is a godly man, and he's going to live by that. He's looking for a high-value woman. Her body count cannot be anything above two. He only wants a high-value woman. He needs his woman to be high-value, submissive. Um, She needs to be traditional, so no job but she needs to be bringing something to the table but she can't have money because she needs to be financially dependent on him the horseshoe cut the typical i am turning 27 this year and i'm already having a receding hairline um and instead of lining it up i'll just have my horseshoe a long do is a little too progressive for him because he is a Christian conservative and he doesn't want to be one of those like soy boy sissies. So the long hair he probably wouldn't rock with too much because it's too it's too liberal. He wouldn't be caught with a man bun. He'd rather die. You know what I'm saying? Oh my god. I I don't even know what to say about this. Like, he he's a bit iffy about Seven. You know, he doesn't like how progressive she is. He can get a little feisty with her. And so he's proud of any of his recessive genes that he's gotten that set him apart from Seven. Because he knows that there's a strong family resemblance here. But anything that sets him apart from his liberal cousin, you know, he's proud. I think this is about the build he should have. Because... He has no muscle. It's just poundage. It's no muscle, just poundage. Just just lard poundage. He's very frugal, you know? He's uptight with his money. He does need a fedora, I think. Um, As far as the others, well, he's a simp. You know, he's introverted and he's an alcoholic. I think these three make the most sense because, you know, he's a simp. He's a Christian conservative. He just likes to stay in and... Posts on his Q and then Facebook groups and you know that's that's his day and going his Discord with his kitten. I feel like he might want to overcompensate for his looks. Like even though he thinks he's the alpha, that's deep. It's rooted in a deep insecurity. So he's gonna try and show off for women, thinking that the more he shows off, the more women he's gonna pull. You get what I'm saying? Like he's gonna be he's gonna be tight with his money, but at the same time, like. When it comes to women, he's going to overcompensate. So I don't think he would settle for a cheap 20000 when he can go for something that is $500 under budget. Okay. Can I save? Save game. Save as. MAGA for life. Okay, this is 100. He is a masterpiece of a man. Um, he's a high value man. He's a Christian conservative, big Trump supporter. Um, he has his own podcast called MAGA Males. Um, yeah, and he's single and ready to mingle. So, yeah. Is And we need to get a job because, um, you know, he wouldn't get caught dead not working. He thinks that Americans have become lazy. He thinks everyone is lazy. He thinks people just need to get up and work and they fucking complain too much. That's all he needs is his shitter. His shitter and a place to sleep. You know what I'm saying, y'all? He just needs a shitter. And just a place to sleep.
Yeah, he'll never admit he's mixed. He'll never admit that. Ever, 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 ever. Ever. Why he got floor tiles on the ceiling? What do you mean? There's nothing wrong with this. Go ahead, take a poo-poo. Oh, you don't need to. Take a shower, then. Wow. What a man. What a man. Obviously, yes, there are scooters around town, but would he be caught on one of those silly little liberal scooters in the city? No. This man rides diesel-fueled only. He's not going to be riding anything that doesn't, that isn't a truck. He would never. How you doing, ma'am? Oh yeah, this is his shit. Y'all hear that song in the back? He would be friends with Tofu. He would. Oh, yes. You've come to the right place. Talk to John. He's in his room. You can go in. The door's open. This is so crazy cuz what job have you ever had where like you're trying to you're trying to apply somewhere and they're like, "Yeah, he's just in the back. Go in his room." What do you mean go in his room? Like what the fuck? Hey, where's where's John at, brother? How you doing, John? Brother? I'm John Diner Jr. Oh, he's I've got black. A job for you. Oh the no. The job is good but difficult and the payment is decent. Here, take a look. It has everything you need to know. He's black. If you are okay. We can sign the contract immediately. Look at the form. He's black. This might be a problem for him. But I think he's so committed to the work that he won't he won't mind it. Welcome to the team. He won't like this, but I think he's committed to the work and he would rather do this than go work at some frilly little liberal cake shop. So when do I come in next, brother? I'm a novice janitor. Okay, well, we have a little bit of free time. We might as well go out and just mingle around the town. Oh, well, no, we'll have to get some food for the house but he's not he doesn't know how to cook he doesn't know how to cook so i'm debating if i want to just have him be one of those like single dads who has like instant food only at the house maybe a couple eggs in the refrigerator with some lunch meat just sitting on the little or if he would want to you know only eat out i think we should go look around town though i think we should go just take a look around the town we have a pharmacy okay that's fantastic what's in here what have you got for sale can i get sick in this game hello i'm not gonna bother talking with you you're one of those colors i don't do that look at this liberal sissy look at him wandering around with his purple liberal sissy soy boy hair i have some words for you sir can I, sir, can I speak with you? Can I have a couple words? Because I'm, I'm, I'm offended. I'm offended by what you're wearing right now, sir. Are you embarrassed to be a real man? Are you embarrassed to be a real man in today's society, sir? Because, because I'm thinking that you, you, you need to, you need to embrace your inner alpha. I have a, I have a podcast called Real Men Wear Diapers, and I think it would help you a lot in your day-to-day -day life, sir. You have a blessed day. All right, let, let, let's keep it pushing. Let's keep it. What about you? You look like a liberal sissy as well. He didn't wash today, though, so he might have a smell. Look at this liberal, goth, blue-haired cunt. I have some What's words up? for you. Are you happy with your life? Yeah, it's great meeting you. Are you happy with your life? Because, because you look a little... You look a little, you know, like you might be lost. And if you want, if you want to help find yourself and become a, become a high value woman, you know, I have a po a podcast called Real Men Wear Diapers, and we discuss the traits of a high value woman. We discuss these things. So it's it's not just a podcast for men; it's a podcast for women as well. If you've lost yourself, or you're just looking for some for some some ways to like up up your value as a woman we discuss those things and how you can get those things done ma'am <laughs> let's make an absurd joke because you know he's an alpha male so he likes to make women uncomfortable nice try 
All right, well, she wasn't really into it. Let's talk about some drinks. Sure thing. She likes strong alcohol. Me too, sister. I like me a little, a little alky, you know? I like a moonshine. High-value women don't wear band t-shirts or the fishnets or the, 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 the cuts. and the, Because even though they just met, he knows, as a man, she'll be attracted to his assertive alpha male dominance. And in this conversation, she'll thoroughly enjoy his alpha male dominance. Flirt. Oh, God. What? Why is she into it? I... You've learned this character is a nymphomaniac? That took a turn that I... Kiss her. What oh. the hell? I thought you were a nymphomaniac. You were asking for it, you bitch. You're wearing those fishnets and you're, and you're accepting my advances towards you. You're a bitch. You were literally asking for it. Oh! What the hell? What do you mean, what the hell? I'm sorry. Okay. I apologize, man. You know, I just got a little ahead of myself. I think you were actually acting a little crazy in that situation. But it's 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 not on it's not either of our faults, okay? It's not either of our faults so you're crazy, you know? Girl, what the fuck are you looking at? Let's go look around and find some more shit to do because I didn't really explore the town before. Damn colors just standing there. Yeah, get your ass on, monkey. All right, let's keep going. I just, you know, I just, I think, I, I think, you know, we need to bring back, we need to bring back some, you know, some segregation in this town. I think, I think people have gotten a little too free willed, and I think people have gotten a little too out in the open with their views and beliefs. And I just think if we went back to the old times when things were right, back in the good old days, things. This is a high-value woman. Now look at her. Hello, ma'am. This is exactly what I need in my life. Let's let's pull out the stops. She's not really feeling my jokes. But you know. Let's make a dark joke. <laughs> you know of fried chicken and watermelon? Nice, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I know you do. <laughs> I'm not mixed. <laughs> what kind of job you got? I like a woman who doesn't work but has her own passive income. Do you work? Yeah. You're an IT support specialist. Oh, baby. It, you know, it's okay because once you once you find a man that, you know, his, his masculine energy, a real alpha's dominant masculine energy will attract a woman and she'll naturally want to submit to him mm -hmm. <laughs> she likes my jokes now i had to butter her up a little bit well you know Jeez, I'm, that's ridiculous yeah well ma'am i'm out looking for for life partner so i i'll put you on my list as a potential life partner but as of for right now i'm a little unsure about you because this you're showing a bit too much skin but but we, I'll, I'll keep you in mind. See you around. Have a, have a good day, ma'am. Well, he'd clog it and then not flip. Fucking liberal colored walking around, looking like she has a bonnet on. One of those, one of those little head things. Can't believe that people, these colors, just go outside with these little head things, and they just look like terrorists. And I, I absolutely am not going for it. Not in America. His butt is just so, it just has such a shape. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know it's not in, or er, Scooter, I know it's not in his nature, but you cannot get anywhere in this hoe unless you ride one of these, because baby, this map is large. And we're gonna have to drive around until we find somewhere for him to get some clothes, because this current outfit, which, you know. Boy, what the f- Okay. 
Now, I'm not even gonna say anything about that. I'm just gonna leave it how it is. I'm too thirsty. Okay, so I gotta find a restaurant. I gotta find somewhere where I can get. Ooh, hello, ma'am. How are you doing? Hello. Hi. You got a lot of skin showing. Oh, you like me. She likes me. <laughs> He's running around with a sink. <laughs> oh, she fucking likes me. He does need an American flag shirt. She likes that was good. me. Thank you. I like you. For sure. For sure. Okay, we're swapping numbers. Okay, I got her number. That's cool. Okay, she fucking likes me. You have a nice day, ma'am. See ma you soon. Yeah. We're gonna have to somehow make it. Unless we cross paths with the... Yeah, the diner. If we cross paths with the diner. Because I have to take my sink home. I have to take my sink home. What's up, bitch? Pull your skirt down. You're showing too much leg, harlot. Well, the diner's right there. So we might as well just go in the diner and get some food anyways. And get a drink. We can just eat it on the floor like before. Because why would I eat it at the table? I'll just bring my sink in, into the diner. They know me. I get an employee discount now. So. Hello, ma'am. Can I put my sink here? Thanks. Hey, can I get a drink and a food? Yeah, I, I'm going to get some fried eggs. I've never eat vegetables. I'm a carnivore. And then a drink. I'll have a juice. Thank you very much. Thirteen dollars. All righty. Enjoy your meal. Thank you very much. I'm gonna eat those off the floor. Thank you very much. I didn't mean to throw that, but I'm gonna drink it. All right, you have a blessed day, ma'am. I think. We need to call up our little lady friend. Let's send her a friendly text. Miss you. Meme. Send her a meme. Literally me. Ha ha ha. Send her, send her another meme. Ha <laughs> ha Check this. Miss you. The way you linger in my fantasies is attempting to... Okay. Alright. Actually, that, that wasn't enough. Let's send her... How are you doing? What are you doing? Hopefully she'll respond. Hopefully. You know what? Oh, I'm getting responses. I'm getting responses. I'm getting responses. Oh. I, I, I will... S Oh! What's this? This looks like my kind of spot. None of that frilly sissy shit. We've got a real live band playing. Real, real conservative looking cuss. I mean, we've got a couple colors in here, but aside from that, they look pretty respectable. Well, he might he might actually be a hipster type. Like he might be cosplaying as a as a rancher. I got a poop and pee. Can I get me a drink, sir? I need a beer. Like a real man. Thank you, sir. Good luck. Thank you. You know I'm an alcoholic, so that really does it for me. <laughs> Who wants to dance? I like this lovely lady right here. How you doing, ma'am? Oh. He's killing that shit. Thanks for the dance, bitch. All right, let's go. Y'all have a bathroom in here? I've got to take a poopy. All right, let's take us a little dumpy. And a pisser. White ass dance. Wait, did someone just walk in the bathroom? Did someone just walk in the... Oh, it's leaking. 
whatever. I can't even actually flirt with him. Why is she following me? No. 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 Hide, hide, hide. Hide in the plant. No! No, 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 no. Oh my god. No! Get away from me. Get away from me. Get away from me! Get away! Take the stairs. Oh my god. Oh my god. Two. Two. Up. Three. No. Go, 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 go. She's coming. No. No. Close the door. Get in bed. Kiss me? Damn! Get out! Are you mad? Get out of my house! Leave my house now! Get out! She won't get out! She won't get out! What the fuck? Get out! I'm horny for you! She's gay? No, I can't. I have one of the homos in my house. I have one of the homos in my house. I can fix you, I swear. She won't get out and she won't what let me kiss fuck, her. Man. She won't let me kiss her. I need to, I need to, I need to wash that, that homo off of me. She said she was a, one of the homosexuals. And I, I, I feel like it, once you touch one of them, it spreads. I have to wash it off. A low-value homosexual woman make advances on me in my own home. She chased me home and tried to make sexual advances on me, saying that she she thought she wanted to change and oh no, and she wanted to spread her gayness to me, and I I wasn't going for it. Well, here's a clothing store. Let's take a look in here. A little modern. This looks good for. Oh, well, it looks like just women's clothes, which I wouldn't be caught dead in, but but this looks like a good place if I'm shopping for 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 my woman. Now, now. <laughs> oh! Oh yeah. We're hitting her up fucking green-haired liberal bitch. So oh my god, Sawyer text me. Sawyer text me. Sawyer text me. Yes, please. I'm ready for a good time. See All right. Why is she laughing emoji at my at my invitation to meet at the cake shop? There she is. How you doing, Sawyer? Hi. You look beautiful tonight. You look very beautiful. All right, let's get us a little cake. Let's get us, let's get her a, a cherry cake and I'll have a, a, a muffin. How does this work? What? you lady where are you go <sighs> Sawyer where are you going 
Sawyer, why are you running from me, Sawyer? I have my leather jacket on for you, Sawyer. Sawyer! Why are you leaving? Sawyer! Sawyer, I'm getting stuck on trees. Sawyer! <laughs> Sawyer! Don't leave me! You're a cunt, but it's fine. All the same. <laughs> What's going on in here? What's up, brother? You look like a respectable man. What's up? How are you doing today, sir? Yeah, nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you too, Mr. Raiden. <laughs> Have you ever kissed a man before? Wow, that's interesting. <laughs> I I haven't. Here's what I can tell you about myself. Oh, you you write poetry. That's a little sissy of you, but you know, to each their own. Flirt. Wow. Oh, he likes me. <laughs> yeah, so if you ever want to try kissing a man platonically, I might, you know, be alright with that. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a respectable man, brother. I like your hair. He's flirting with me. He's flirting with me. I'm not a homo. I'm not a homo. Oh. I'm not a homo. Hey, do you want to swap phones? He asked me. Let's stay in touch and set a date to meet. See you around. I'll never forget you, brother. MAGA for life is crazy. It's who he is. It's who he is.